Hi everyone, it is Halloween, that means everyone who writes Cypress Test should use Cypress Dark Halloween theme, which you can install as a plugin, and let's see how it looks. Well, I don't have an example here. Okay, here's how it looks, right? It modifies all the colors in the browser so that it looks like a Halloween scene. Now, let me try running uh, the Halloween spec just to show how it generates a video and saves a screenshot. So I'm going to run uh, Cypress with Halloween theme. It saved the video. So let's open the video and take a look at that. Okay, it switches to the Halloween CSS. Okay, everything looks spooky. The page tries to inject some ads, which I hate. Okay, now here's a problem. If this is the best video, it doesn't look very good, right? The resolution video is way too small. I can take a look at the resolution. It's 1280 by 720, which doesn't look enough for this particular website. We can also look at the screenshot uh, open. And if we zoom in, we can't really see the sharp icons or graphics. Again, the resolution of this saved screenshot is 1280 by 720. Now that's the resolution of entire window, of entire browser, okay? Inside the browser, uh, probably a third of all the pixels are taken by the command log, leaving only what? Uh, I don't know, maybe eight, seven hundred pixels wide for your website. Now you want to increase the entire browser window size. You want to, for example, use, you know, 2K, 4K to actually for uh, render the whole window, that will have a lot more pixels for rendering your website. Okay, so let's see how to do it. You can go to the Cypress documentation and search uh, change um, window resolution, mm, uh, change video resolution, uh, resolution screenshot. Okay, is there a way to modify a screenshot with resolution, right? Now you can modify it. Right? By passing a bunch of flags for each browser, you can set a different flag, you know, Electron, Chrome, Firefox. You can also parse the input probably yourself from the environment. Or I've written a plugin that allows you to do all that with a single command line argument. Okay, so let's see how we can use this plugin. So I'm going to install Cypress High Resolution in my project. What else? I uh, have to add it to the plugin, right? Because the plugin actually launches the site, I mean the browsers. So we're gonna go back to my support, I mean plugins file. Right now it's empty, so I'm just gonna pass on and config to Cypress High Resolution. What else? Okay, so here's how I can use this, right? I will use the environment variable called resolution to pass either resolution of a name like 4K or high. So let's try with high. So I'm gonna take my previous command and I will add and resolution. Okay, now notice when it says a screenshot, the screenshot is now is not 1280 by 720, but 1920 by 1080. Okay, so it's already larger. Let's look at the screenshot. Okay, you can see that this is a large high resolution image Everything is much, much crisper, okay, compared to what we had before. And let's look at the videos. Okay, the size of the video is much larger and the resolution is higher. Notice we can see the text much, much better. Now we're using a lot more pixels for the browser window, which leaves a lot more pixels for our viewport where the website is rendered. Okay, uh, can we uh, specify particular resolution, yes, we can specify width and height using X, or I like to generate a 4K videos, right, which if your machine allows you to do, is pretty sweet. Okay, let's see. Again, when you run this on CI, this runs in headless mode only, and if you have enough resources for the browser to generate 4K video, right, then you will have crystal clear videos. Okay, notice the screenshot is now in 4K resolution. It takes longer to encode the video, obviously. And let's open the video. Ooh, it's giant. 
Okay, so now we have plenty of pixels for both the command log and our website. Now we're not using the full available space. So I suggest when you run this on CI in non-interactive mode, you actually pass parameters to change the viewport to higher number. So for example, I can say config because these are config values, viewport equals, let's say double them, and viewport height. So we're gonna generate high resolution video by scaling the browser window to 4K and increasing the viewport inside to uh, twice the size that we had before. So that it actually uses all this empty gray space available to us. Let's see how it goes. First, let's look at the video. Let's see how it uses the real estate now inside the iframe. Oh, <laughs> we have so many pixels that now we can see the complete page served by the server. And let's look at the screenshot. The screenshot is much, much nicer. You can zoom in a lot and see all the details. So this is my plugin called Cypress High Resolution. You should try it out. Let me know if there are any problems.